as I said, it's a trust issue with the club, okay? Whereas yeah. before you turned him in. And that's the same with the driver, okay? Yeah, oh yeah, definitely, yeah, definitely, yeah, okay? If we look at. That's probably your face there. That's probably the face there. So it's still a little bit close, to be fair. Yeah. But I think over time that'll get a little bit more comfortable. And the ball does keep going to the right. Hang on, that's the club face straight. For me, though, ball position is fine there. Back of the hill, left hill there, maybe a couple of inches, that's fine. Yeah. You're making good contact with the golf ball, so that's yeah. fine with that yeah. club there, okay? Nothing to worry about in terms of that thing. The issue really in terms of the swing, and I think why we see some top shots, this on the left-hand side, you, if you actually look at the strike, and I'll show you now when it comes through, this is actually a pretty good contact, isn't it? Yeah. The club base now is middle of the golf ball there. Yeah. The ball is just going really low because there's no lock on the golf club. Yeah. And then the arms then sort of pull round the body. Yeah. This sort of tucked up, really cramped yeah. position. Your left arm has disappeared and your left yeah. hand is yeah. just about kind of there. Whereas this one here now, as we swing through, you can see the ball now has got a little bit of angle yeah. to it, okay? And your arms now are swinging through a little bit further. You've got a bit more space there for your arms to go. Yeah. Thus, the swing now finishing more over your left shoulder there rather than kind of yeah. <laughs> round your body. Yeah. And I would say for you, as your default fault, so we say, or default mechanism, yeah, yeah. you always get your hands very low. And you sort yeah. of swing around here, trying to pull the ball left. And that's just someone who's suffering with a slice. Yeah. They're trying to hit the ball non-right, as you said. Yeah. And they'll try and pull their arms left, turn the club in, and just hoik it left. They get away with it with the eyes because you've got angle on the club face, yeah. and it's okay. When you've got less lofted clubs, yeah. a drive or a three, or even a th longer irons or hybrids, that follow through round there is not going to be conducive to quality goal shots on yeah. a consistent basis. Okay. okay? Yeah, yeah. If we can finish shots and okay, right, see where your hands are, and even as a non-golfer, that looks to me a much better position. I mean, obviously you play yeah. golf, so you can see, but then that there now, much on the left side, your right foot's up on its toe, your right foot there, you're leaning back, it just all looks a bit like hips yeah. are back, yeah. shot, yeah. all that well, stuff. Right. Yeah. And, you, and basically what's happened is your body just reacted to what you're trying to do to hit it and it's like yeah. please kind of go around here as opposed to okay where's my target my target is down there yeah. I'm just going to go bush and head it to it that is, is swinging it rather than hitting it exactly and I think if you're on the golf course don't be a, don't think hitting the ball left to right is a negative as long as it's not 50 yards left to right yeah. the problem is if we're on the golf course and we aim straight to try and hit the perfect straight shot that no one's ever going to do on a consistent basis and then try to hit it to the left in the swing, we're going to encourage more of this movement. So if you're standing on I know, the first on the Mac or the button or whatever, any hole, if your target is, <coughs> we'll draw some lines on here, if your target, say your golf ball is there and the flag is up there, yeah. if your target is obviously in a straight line, now that's your target line, if your natural shape of shot goes that way, don't aim for the flag. Aim there and let it come back. As long as that gap there's only, I don't know, yeah. 10 yards maybe, yeah, yeah, that's yeah. fine. Most golfers have played with a shape left to right or right to left all their life, yeah. but they know what they're going to do. If it was 40 yards, then I'd say that's too much because then you can't aim that far left on someone. Yeah. The 10th on the Mac, for example, you can't aim in the trees and yeah. hope for the best. Yeah. Okay. So as long as it's sort of 5, 10 yards, with these conditions, if the wind's off the left, that might be 20 yards. Yeah. But you're only hitting the ball left to right 10. Yeah. Mother Nature's doing the rest for you. Yeah. Okay. But you've got to make sure you set up for that. Yeah. Don't aim straight to the flag and go, oh, I don't want to go to the right now, and then try to well, hoik it left. I remember when I played it uh, well, on <coughs> Wednesday, it, it was quite windy. Yeah. And when I played the, the third on the Mac, yeah. I aim for the trees. Yeah, yeah, you've got exactly. Yeah. yeah, you've got to exactly. And then it went the other side. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> the thing is that what often people find, if you've got to aim for trouble, like trees or bunkers yeah. or whatever, it's very hard to actually hit it to the target you're aiming for because your target now, in a sense, is actually the trees yeah. to allow for things to happen. Yeah. But what often then happens is people sort of go, I don't want to go in the trees, <laughs> and they just yeah, hit it 50 yeah. yards right. So it's having that discipline that when you know you're on the golf course, and it's trust, as I said, that I'm going to stand there, so hit the golf ball. Yeah, so let the club sit, sit exactly as he sits down there. Don't manipulate or twist him, okay? You should be able to, at address, if we keep the club there, see the face, yeah? yeah? If I do this, there's no, you can't, and that's kind of how much you were twisting there, and you can't really see the face there, can you? Yeah, same with the drive, yeah, exactly. And we always just turn the club face in, and I kind of get it in some ways why people do it. It's like a, a, a help just to please it, the ball somewhere non right, but yeah, let that club, yeah. Let him just sit down flat on the ground, okay? Yeah, yeah. This ground, that, that, that's probably open, that, that's square there, okay? Do you think it would help me if I had this feet? 
Uh, do you use the line to line up? No, no, no I never say no. It's not there. Exactly, yeah. I wouldn't say, uh, I, th I think what would happen then you start focusing so much on this and that, you get you probably get confused, to be fair. So okay. focus on what the head's doing, yeah, okay? Yeah. And that's where that ball's going to go. Make sense, okay? Yeah.